Hey guys, MRA back again, and the excitement continues for the new Godzilla 2014 movie release. It is now May 13, so just a couple days away from the official release here in the U.S., and I can't wait to see it. There's already been some great reviews of the film, so I'm very much amped to see it in a couple days. And I just received my Godzilla Art of Destruction book here. And so I'm going to go through it and spoil a little bit of it for myself. I'm not going to read anything because I don't really want to know too much about the uh, plot points. But I do want to see some of the images. I don't mind, you know, getting a taste of what I can expect from the film. So for those of you who don't want to be spoiled, maybe, I don't know, check out this video later on after you see the film. But if you don't mind, if you're curious about this book and uh, don't mind seeing some images, uh, keep on watching. So I'm giving you fair warning, guys. Uh, you know, watch the video if you don't care or uh, just wait till later on, I suppose. So anyways, here we go. Nice hardcover book. I picked mine up on Amazon. Um, looks like it should retail for about 45 bucks, but on Amazon, I think it was a little bit cheaper, probably around 30 bucks. I don't recall right now. So, first couple pages there, some really great images. You can see uh, Gareth Edwards there on the set. Toho Studios. And concept design there of uh, pilots looking down at what looks like a frozen Godzilla. And uh, Gareth there with a model of Godzilla from the film. So let me just kind of flip through it. Great concept art. So basically I'm just going to give you a, an idea of what you can expect from this great art book here. I'm flipping through it from the back. Great scene there with Godzilla and what looks like the Muto or Muto, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, creature. This is from the uh, Godzilla encounter at last year's San Diego Comic Con. Looks like a submarine smashed into the mountainside there. So I don't know what made it into the film and what didn't get, you know, put into the film and ended up on the cutting room floor. But just some great behind the scenes stuff. Some images of, again, of the uh, Muto creature. I guess the winged version that we got a taste of in the uh, latest trailers. Again, you know, the final designs might look a little bit different from what we see here, but just to give you guys some ideas, some other creature designs, images of Godzilla, some ideas they had for his fins, more images of Godzilla. So this is the stuff you guys probably want to see in the art book. Wow, that's a pretty freaky looking rendition of Godzilla. So again, just different ideas that they took to approach the new Godzilla. And I'm pretty happy with the final outcome. That looks more like the uh, traditional classic Godzilla. Really cool fold out piece here. With some more concept designs for Godzilla. So, let me fold this back up. More designs of the Muto or Muto creature. 
And I'll flip through it a little bit faster here. Brian Cranston. So you get an idea of what's in this book. I mean, if you're a Godzilla fan or you love these art of books, this might be something you might want to pick up. And I saw something at the back here. It looks like this also came with... Okay, it's some kind of a poster. Let's see if I can open this up with my one hand. Okay, here we go. Basically a movie, miniature movie poster uh, that you can pull out here. Okay, so anyways, giving you guys an idea of what's in this art of book. So uh, you can pick it, pick it up now on Amazon. And again, you know, hopefully the film is going to be amazing. I'm expecting it to be. So, uh, yep, that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video, this little uh, preview and sneak peek into this amazing Godzilla Art of Destruction book. Okay, guys, thanks again for watching. Stay tuned for more. Keep on collecting. Bye-bye.